Hello YouTube, my name is Sarah if you didn't know, and today's situation is going to be Lululemon shorts. Quick side note before I begin, I do have a different background than I normally do in my videos, and I did use an intro in this video, so let me know how you feel about the intro, if you like it, if I should try a different intro, or if you don't like intros at all, leave your comments down below. So, like I said, today's video is going to be about Lululemon shorts. You may be wondering why I'm talking about shorts nearing the end of summer if you live in Canada, where I live. But a lot of places obviously do stay hot year round and I think that now is a way better time to get these shorts if you're interested because they're actually in stock in stores and online whereas the peak of summer you couldn't get shorts anywhere so I would have felt bad posting this knowing that you couldn't really get them anywhere but now either you can make the investment for next year or come back to this video next year when you are looking for shorts. I'm going to be showing these shorts from the perspective of somebody who does have a bigger bum and thicker thighs. Every body is beautiful, that's just what my body looks like, and I would love for people who have a similar body type to me know a couple of the shorts that I think work well for our type of body. Even if you don't have this type of body, you may also figure out some shorts from Lululemon that you want to try out, as this is my collection of basically all the shorts I own from them, so yeah, let's get right into it. I'm going to start off with more of the everyday lounge shorts, really the ones that I think everybody can wear, so we'll get into those. My first pair of shorts is the Inner Glow Shorts. I have these shorts in the Model fabric. They are 3 inch inseam, obviously they're black, they have pockets, a drawstring to adjust the waist size, and are just so loose, comfortable, and breathable. I would really recommend these shorts for anybody as everyday shorts, like I said, because they're just so comfortable and they're very flattering on tons of body types. These shorts are $64 and currently on Lululemon, I see them in gray, and, but I really do recommend these shorts. Actually, I recommend basically all of these shorts, but these ones are awesome and I wear them all the time for lounging, sleeping, every day. My second type of shorts I'm going to be talking about are the aligned shorts. I believe these fall into more of the category of lounging and every day because I don't believe you should work out in these shorts. The new fabric is very delicate if you don't already know. Check out my Secret to Align videos which will be linked in the cards and linked down below. That will tell you everything you need to know about the Align fabric, Nulu, and why it's delicate, how to take care of it. But anyhow, I have two versions of this shorts because they come in a range of lengths. I have one length at the 6 inch inseam, which is in black, and then I have three other pairs in the 10 inch inseam, so I have this white pair, this is the We Are From Nimbus Space, I have graphite grey, and then I have this tie dye one. So with the Align shorts, I prefer to get the 10 inch inseam in a size 4, that way the pant does ride up a little bit and it fits me a little bit better, just because 10 inch is a little bit of a weird length on me, but I am too lazy to get them hemmed. But this pair is a size 6, they still work, I just prefer the size 4. The only thing I will say about these shorts that I don't love in the 10 inch is that they are super high rise and you can't get them not super high rise. For me, I have a very short torso so they literally go to under my sports bra and it does look a little bit weird but I do roll them down and that's fine and if I'm just hanging out it's really not that big of a deal but I do wish that these came in just the regular high rise but oh well. As for the 6 inch on me, I prefer to get a size 6 because the 4 is just too tight and shows my bum but the 6 has enough fabric, stretches out well. Although these are delicate pants and you do have to take care of them, they are amazing and so comfortable. I highly recommend checking these out. The Align shorts are $58 to $64 depending on the length, color, that type of stuff. So my next pair of shorts in the kind of everyday wear lounge are the Spring Breakaway shorts. This is what they look like. If you've seen any of my hauls so far this year, I do a monthly Lululemon haul at the end of every month. You may have seen these or some of the other shorts I'm showing. In the spring breakaway, it's a 3 inch inseam. It's made of the swift fabric, so it's extremely lightweight, extremely breathable, great for summer when it's hot. They're four way stretch, so you're very comfortable as per usual. They have pockets and a drawstring so you can adjust the fit, have some keys or cards or your phone in your pocket. 
This color is the Serene Blue. I actually think I may have messed up the color in my haul, so if you're now seeing this, this is actually Serene Blue. I have them in a size 8 personally, just because I like the fit of the leg a little bit better than I did in the size 6. And these shorts are $64. So with all of these everyday shorts, for somebody who has thicker thighs and a bigger bum, I'm extremely comfortable in all of them. I, they all fit, even though they're a range of sizes. Just a little thing I like to say is that the number of size you buy is what fits you, not what defines you. So don't worry about if you're normally a size zero, but you need a size four. I do believe that all you are is finding clothes that fit you. It's not about defining you as big or small or skinny or fat or anything. It's just your body and that's totally okay. So, moving on from that little aside, those are all of my comfy everyday shorts, so I'm going So now I'm going to move into looser workout shorts. I really only wear to work out. I don't normally wear these every day. So, the first one I have is the lean in short. This is what it looks like. It's black, has kind of a thick waistband, and then billows out into these shorts. These are an older style, so unless you look on Poshmark or Depop or Facebook Marketplace, you may not be able to find these but personally these are some of my favorite shorts because the leg is just so flowy these I believe are two inch inseam which nowadays I would never buy a two inch inseam my butt would be hanging out it would be so tight but something about these shorts does work though like I said I only wear these to work out I don't really wear these every day which I don't remember what I paid for them but I'm assuming it was in the $60 range and I have had them for probably four years and I still wear them and I still love them. So my next looser workout shorts are the Hottie Hot shorts. Personally, if I'm being honest, I don't love these shorts. I only keep them because I've just had them. They're just convenient, I guess. And if I have nothing else to wear, I'll pick these, but they're not my first pick. So this is what they look like. I have two pairs, one in a navy blue, one in pink. And these are a low rise on me. They're considered low to mid rise, but on me, they run very low rise. They do have a drawstring, which is nice, so you can adjust the fit. And I have these in a size 6 tall, because I do have a side zipper, so you can fit like keys or a card. I find that these do f fit really tight across the bum, so that's why I don't reach for these all the time. And on my blue pair, I've actually cut the lining out to try and make it a little bit more high-waisted. But my pink ones still do have the lining. So if you have a lining in a pair of shorts that you don't like from Lululemon, just cut it out. It's not going to change the pant. You're not going to unravel anything. Just carefully cut at the top of the lining, like here, and you're going to be fine. That's my opinion on the Hottie Hots. I personally don't wear them that much, and I think they don't work that well for bigger butts. But some people disagree with me, so don't take my word as gold. Go ahead and try them on, but personally, I wouldn't, and I wouldn't blindly order these guys online. So these ones are considered a 4-inch inseam. It's, I don't know about that. <laughs> they feel a lot shorter than that to me. And the Hottie Hot shorts are $58. They are designed for running, and I'm not a runner, so maybe that's why I don't get the maximum use out of it, but... Okay, my next pair of shorts are these guys. They are the Track That Short in Lemon Vibe, so like a neon color. They have a drawstring, which is great, and the best thing about these shorts is that they're 5 inch inseam. That is a wonderful length for somebody with a bigger bum and thicker thighs. It actually goes over the bum. It doesn't fit tight. I'm very comfortable wearing these. I personally have them in a size 6. These shorts as well have the zipper pocket the way the Hottie Hot short does. These are made of the Swift fabric as well. A lot of the running shorts are made of that fabric because it's very light, very breathable, and comfortable to run in. I like these shorts as well because the length, my thighs don't rub together, which is obviously uncomfortable for anyone that that happens to, but these shorts are perfect for that not happening. They do have a liner, and like I previously said, you can cut it out. In these shorts, when you're wearing them, in some lighting you can kind of see the lining, but I actually don't have that bad of an issue with that. Some people say they do, but the solution to that would just be to get a darker color. I think that only happens because this color is so light. And this short is $58. Now I will be moving on to my workout shorts that are tight fitting. These also double as great biker shorts to wear every day. These shorts are my most versatile. They can be used for casual, working out. So the first pair are the Fast and Freeze. These shorts are so comfortable. This is a Naked Sensation short, which is just like the Aligns, but they're meant for working out. 
The Fast and Free are made out of the New Lux fabric, which is a naked sensation pant that is very lightweight, breathable, sweat wicking, quick drying, and cool to touch. I wouldn't say it's like super spandexy, but that is a similar material you could compare it to, but it's just way more compressive but breathable at the same time that I would say spandex is. And these really feel like you're wearing nothing. And I like the length of them because they can be used for running, biking, spin class, that type of stuff where normally your thighs would rub together and that may cause some people discomfort like it does me, but the length of this make sure that doesn't happen and you still feel great wearing them. I do like to just wear these casual as well as working out because they are just so comfortable. Nice thing about these is they also have pockets for big enough to fit a phone as well as pockets around the waistband and they have a drawstring. They do have free hem at the bottom which just means there's no seam so it doesn't squeeze or cut in. These I do have in a size 4. I find in the New Luxe material for it to be tight and fitting, I do have to go with the lower side as I go between a 4 or a 6 in Lululemon bottoms. Though if you do want them to not be as compressive, you can size up and get your bigger size and just utilize the drawstring when they stretch out. So these are great. The seaming on the bum also makes your bum look so nice just because of this arch. I quite like that a lot. And these shorts are $74 and I have them in the 10 inch inseam. My next shorts that I'll be talking about are the Wonder Under shorts. They are black, they are 10 inch inseam, and this is the Earth Day edition pair of pants. These were only on the website for like a day or two, but the logo is actually green, and these are made with like 50% less water or something compared to their other shorts. So I thought they were pretty cool. I ordered these online. Unfortunately, unless you look, look at Depop or Poshmark, you may not actually be able to find these, but hopefully next year they're back again. But they are made out of the Luxstream fabric, which is the most classic fabric. A lot of people know about that one. It is the most comparable to something like a spandex based pant. It is a lightweight, sweat wicking, breathable fabric as well. It's just more of a hugged sensation. So if you like to know your pants are there, but don't want to be too bothered, these are good. There's not a lot of seaming, so it's a nice basic pant, and they just have the pocket in the waistband like a lot of the basic leggings from Lululemon does. I have these in a size four. For me, Luxstream does relax a little bit when you're working out, and if I go with the six, they tend to fall down or I need to pull them up, but the four stays snug enough and it's not see-through on me, so. The last short I have is the Wonder Train short. If you don't know about Wonder Trains or Everlux, these are my favorite workout pants, my favorite everyday pants. It's my favorite fabric from Lululemon. It even beats out the Align because Everlux is a mixture between basically the Luxstream and the Align. The outside of the pant is going to feel soft to touch the way the Aligns do, but, but the inside is going to be fit similar to Luxstream as it's just more compressive, meant for working out. Everlux is the fastest drying, super lightweight, and cool to touch pant that you will ever wear. I love them so much. If you've had something in the in movement pant, this is what these are, and also the invigorate pants is made in the same material. So as for the shorts, I have three pairs. I have a black in the eight inch inseam, and then I have true navy in the six, and I have a black in the six as well. These pants do have a drawstring. Basically like all of the Lululemon shorts have a drawstring, which is great. And I just love this material. It is so comfortable. It really does feel cool to touch, and I feel that it holds its shape really well. These are the main pants that I'm not like pulling and adjusting on, and I have them all in a size 6. Regardless of the leg length, I find that the 6 fits me really good. It also does have that classic pocket in the waistband that lots of the Lululemon pants have, and these guys run from $64 to $74. Alright, those are all of my favorite shorts. From Lululemon, I have tried out a lot of different ones that I've decided not to buy, but these are the ones that I would recommend if you have a bigger bum or thicker thighs. Definitely check them out. Even if you don't, they're still great shorts. I love all of them very much, and I think they have value for everybody regardless of your body type. So thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, let me know. What are your favorite shorts from Lululemon? Comment down below and let me know that as well. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.